Hello, Georgie B back again. Today I'd like to show how I made this card. It's quite a quick and easy card. And I made one like this for my granddaughter. So I thought I'd show you how to make it. I've just remembered some I haven't got. I forgot me um, die cutting machine. Didn't bring it to the table. Anyway, to make this card, I've got a card base of eight and a quarter by five and seven eighths, scored at four and one eighth, a piece of two pieces of white card at five and five eighths by three and seven eighths, one for the inside and one for the top, and this I've already embossed in the um, embossing folder actually goes with this flowers artful something or other so I've embossed that looks like uh, plastic on your walls before you smooth it out that's what it reminds me of so that's a go on top let me see if I can find the name of this oh that's the new cup I don't know if it's been carried over, I'll have a look in a minute. Right. This one is called Painted Texture. It's there. So let's see if it's in the new car. Oh yeah. Carried over, it's in the new catalogue. Oh, I used another one the other day, doesn't look like that's been carried over. Typical. I'll still use them if they're carried over or not. So, yes, painted texture. Um, I've also got a piece of basic white at two inches. Oh, that's not two inches. Hmm. By four inches. That's not two inches. I shall measure it in a minute. Right, this measures two and three quarters by four inches. So I did that one too small. Two and three quarters by four inches. And that will go over there like that. So, we stamp set, obviously art gallery and I'll be using this image here and then I'm also using Little Delights this was in the last Christmas one I never used it but I'm going to use them birthday wishes there. I think that's why I bought that stamp set for the birthday wishes so that's what we're going to do. So I've got some scraps now. And we're going to stamp this flower twice. So first of all we're going to stamp it, stamp, stamp it in pear pizzazz. I can tell I don't use this one very often. Clean it up. 
because we're going to stamp it now in I've got Bermuda Bay and Coastal Cabana so we're going to stamp it in I don't know why I did it like that Coastal Cabana stamp out so I forgot to get out the little one in the middle and then with Bermuda Bay I've never done this combination before so see what it looks like oh. I think that looks quite nice right and then with the piece the two and three quarters by four inch and with Bermuda Bay, we're going to stamp our birthday wishes right at the bottom. Like that. That looks actually quite nice. Right, now we need our cutting plates and our die that goes with the set and we're going to cut these out. On this one I'm only paying attention to the top flowers because I'll be chopping off the leaves. And then we want the leaves here. So we have to cut out it all. Right, what we're going to do with the coloured part, we are going to gently snip off the uh, leaves, the stalk. And what we'll do is we'll glue that bit on there to go on here. Now I don't like them leaves. We need a lighter leaf. I'm going to do a lighter one. Let's do it again. All right. Um, I know. Soft sea foam. Let's try them in that. Uh, 
that's too too light. Yeah, that's too light. Let's try again. But let's try. What have I got here? Granny apple green. And I can hear you saying, you're wasting my time. Let's just try a pair of pizzazz in. Stamp it off. Because that is quite dark. It's really dark. Oh no, I was going to stamp off on it. Can't make my mind up what colour I like. They're definitely too dark. Nah. I'm going to stick with the first one. What am I like? This is why it takes me so long to make cards because I can never make my mind up on colours. Anyway, we're going to stick with this one. flowers on like that and then that will go on there like that and then that will go over there like that I still think this is too big I'm going to cut some of that off because I don't like it that big Measure that. That is two and a quarter by four. Two and a quarter by four, that's better. Like that, right. This needs to go on dimensionals. Nope. 
Right, let's get some sticking. Put this on your base. And this down as well, going flat. And place that just there. And now we add some gems, so just the normal three, like that. And the inside one, we will just do my normal sentiment, wishing you the most beautiful day. I honestly thought I'd put that on upside down then. Wouldn't be the first time I've done that. So there is my... I quite like the colour now. My card for today. Hope you like it. If you do, give us a thumbs up. If you'd like to see more of my cards, please subscribe. And if you press the bell icon, you'll be notified of any more videos I upload. All I can say is thanks for watching and I hope to see you again soon.